That's right. We're getting out of town again. We're on our way to San Diego. Are you excited, babe? Yeah. Okay. Now, what's cool about this is, as you well know, it is very expensive at this time because everybody, everybody is traveling. But I think they call it credit card hacking. I guess it's that, that's what it is. Um, whatever they call it, get a credit card, get some points on it because this vacation is using all points. And so it made me feel better just to be able to put all this on points and we can go down and stay in an overpriced hotel in San Diego. That is a Dutch Dutch pancake. You roll up a pancake with lemon and powdered sugar. Twenty minutes to get here. Fifteen minutes to try and find. Fifteen twenty minutes no, to try and find. No, I feel parking. like it was thirty. Okay, she feels like it's thirty. Maybe it was. And then, and I think we finally got. And then we got some rentals, which is magical. They are rusty, but they are magical they because we have. That's right, shade, which for our pasty white asses is necessary. Necessary. Anyways, we're having a great time. Look at me. This is how far we are from the water. All right, so where are we headed? Uh, we're going to Little Italy in San Diego. Little Italy, trying to get some uh, Italian food for cheap. Yes. Um, I don't know. We have good Italian food in LA, but we don't have a Little Italy. No. And this is fun, and it's cool. It's got yeah. a vibe. We're excited about that. No reservations. It's Saturday night, so we'll see what happens. <laughs> I have a good feeling about this. We have a good feeling. We have a good feeling. As long feeling. as we, keep go we get going.
This is nice. Let's go get some towels. So we, I pretty much want to tell a story about our amazing, amazing vacation so far. You've seen, we've done a lot. We've, we fit a lot of things in, which this little guy was uh, not exactly prepared for. We lived a pretty quiet lifestyle at home. And obviously being uh, stuck in a house all 2020, he's like, um, let's go home. Let's stay home. He wanted to, he wanted to be in the hotel room, the hotel room mostly. Yeah. But yesterday was funny because we finally got him down to the pool. We're chilling. We got to see a friend, Adara, which was amazing too. She's so and lovely. she was so welcoming too, to like to escape and, and come to the hotel and, and relax. So I know how that is too when you're local and you get to go to a hotel and relax. But it was funny because I was like, hey, I need, let's go get uh, Arthur some sunblock, all of us some sunblock, which we failed miserably at, and, and also get him some juice and, and like yogurt and such. The elevators in the hotel room are Back. bad. Too. Yeah. they're bad. They're not like not like Vegas. If anybody's ever been to Vegas, you know the hotel the, the elevators go crazy fast, and there's always an elevator coming. Not here. <clears throat> this place is just old enough that the elevators are pretty slow, and there's a lot of people here. I mean, there's a lot of people. This, it's Saturday. The cities are woke. Yeah, it's a weekend, and it's Saturday. So, so we just became accustomed to waiting for the elevator. So Arthur and I come up. We get some stuff from the hotel room, and he's in no shirt, sunglasses. And the swimming trunks and we go sit down at the couch at the elevator bay and people walk up now you gotta remember whoever sits at the couch at the elevator bay no one really. no one but we've just been here for a day and we're like it's gonna take a while folks and so a family comes in looks at us and of course they make a comment and give us give a smile and then another family comes in and they came up and kind of give us an odd look and then another family comes in and I could tell they literally like, are those people sitting? And then Arthur goes, hey dad, maybe we should get up. I was like, yeah, let's, let's, let's stand up. And so we stand up yeah. and then the elevator comes and they're like, it's going up. And, and they're, the, the families were very nice. They saw that we were the first ones there. So one family was like, here, you guys go ahead. And they're like, oh, it's going up. I'm like, we're getting on anyways. Because the elevators are that, that slow. We're like, no, I'm not waiting for another one. We'll take this up. And we're pretty high anyways. So we take it up one level and it goes right back down. So I knew all those people were gonna be waiting for us. <laughs> and Arthur opens his arms as the elevator opens and goes, welcome everybody. <laughs> <laughs> and pretty much from then on was a hit of the elevator. Mm -hmm. All the way down, even at the lobby, someone commented on your glasses. They're like, hey, cool glasses, buddy. I, uh, I know. And he says, I know. <laughs> that, that was his response, I know. Arthur, what up? What happened at the pool yesterday? What's your favorite part? Um, standing up on the pool. We didn't oh. even realize it. We didn't even know it. I was sitting there, he was clinging to me, and Megan looks at me and goes, he probably can stand. It's three feet. And I'm like, I look over three feet. I was like, oh my God, I think he is. I think he's three feet, nine inches. <laughs> it was like a click. It was a click. So I can't believe how tall down. he is. That's nuts. Yeah. So he put his, put, put his feet down. He was in heaven. Yeah. He was in heaven. He actually asked to go to the pool. And that's actually big Very rare. Yeah. We, I got him in swimming lessons two years ago. Hi. 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 You did it. I know. Okay, I guess that's enough. You want to say We're going to be on our way. Um, goodbye. Love you. Stay your foot. <laughs>